my research is on the critically endangered Fitzroy Falls spiny crayfish or Uasca starawallis and the behavioural interactions between itself and the invasive common yabby or Carax destructor. So the Fitzroy Falls region is south of the um, Southern Highlands area. So it's made up of agricultural land as well as we've got Water New South Wales over here which um, is the utiliser of the Fitzroy Falls Reservoir. The critically endangered Fitzroy Falls crayfish has low population so we're trying to find out in the field uh, why that's happening. So what I've been doing is collecting specimens from the field of both the endangered species and the invasive species. Uh, after I've taken 10 specimens back to the lab of each species, I've been doing conducting behavioural trials on uh, both of the species to find out what exactly is going on out in the field and how they are behaviourally interacting with each other. Getting to know them behaviourally has been really interesting. So the U.S. Castara Wallace or the um, endemic species here are, um, yeah, they're extremely um, aggressive in their displays. So they'll usually, if I approach them, they'll um, raise their kelly pads quite high and then start walking back. Um, and then the Karax Destructor, I would consider them like that chilled out guy at uni, just don't really care that you're there. Um, they've even been as bold to come up to me um, when they're in their individual holding tanks and actually like tap on the glass to ask to be fed. The endangered uh, Fitzroy Falls crayfish only has about 12 kilometres of habitat which it utilises, it's not found anywhere else um, and it's recently been listed as critically endangered because their habitat is so limited it's extremely important to find out why their population is declining um, and one of those thoughts is that the invasive common yabby is causing that through competitive and behavioural um, interaction, so literally out-competing the natives for limited resources such as food and shelter. So I got into this area because I am really passionate about conservation. Um, yeah, I just fell in love with on-the-ground research and getting out there and making a difference. Like, that's where I see myself being. Yeah, I have a special interest in aquatics and um, especially freshwater um, species as well as marine species as well. Um, yeah, I just think they're the most amazing creatures and we know so little about them compared to, you know, their la land faunal counterparts. So yeah, I just love to get on the ground and learn more about them and getting people involved in such little known species is also really rewarding. Mm -hmm.